Here's what you missed last weekend in the world of real estate. Distress is stressing out real estate investors. Columbia Property Trust, a large office landlord controlled by PIMCO, has defaulted on $1.7 billion in loans tied to seven buildings across the country, marking one of the largest office defaults since the start of the latest economic downturn. In Los Angeles, Brookfield walked away from $784 million in loans connected to two of the firm's trophy office towers in downtown Los Angeles, 777 South Figueroa Street and the Gas Company Tower at 555 West 5th Street. Plus, trouble may be brewing in San Francisco. The loan for 555 California Street, owned by Vornado Realty Trust and the Trump Organization, was put on a loan server watch list for potential trouble. The owners are current on the $1.2 billion in mortgage debt secured by the 52-story building, but watch lists indicate potential challenges threatening a borrower's ability to stay current. In Miami, development site prices dipped in the third and fourth quarters of last year, largely due to the rising interest rates according to developers and brokers who spoke to TRD. In Miami, Maria Lamas, the ex-wife of Shoma CEO Masood Sojai, and her daughters Annalise and Lilibet Sojai, sued Masood Sojai's current wife Stephanie Sojai, alleging defamation when Stephanie discussed her marriage and career on a podcast. For more headline real estate news, subscribe to TheRealDeal.com and follow us at The Real Deal.